Well, hello there. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Atlas. We're back in with another episode looking at another cryptocurrency. In today's episode, we are focusing on Enigma, aka ENG. Today's date is January 6, 2020. The time is 6.04 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Take a look very briefly at the coin market cap side because we will be coming back to this later. Enigma is labeled as approximately 39 cents or 0.397265 United States dollars with a 2.45% change. First though, we have to ask the big question, what is Enigma? If we head over to the blog.enigma.co website, which I'll be including a link in the description below as always. So if you wish to do more research on this, which I highly encourage you to do so, you are able to do so. According to their website, they describe this as the following. New to Enigma? Start here. At Enigma, we're working to secure the decentralized web. Use this through thorough introductory guide to learn more about us. Welcome to the Enigma blog. Whether you're, you've followed our project from its earliest stages in 2015, or you're just learning about Enigma now, we want to make it easy for you to search through our writing, resources, and code. Here you will find a table of contents for all things Enigma. This includes everything we're all about from the team to the token. We'll also share some resources for how to follow and get involved with our project, our protocol, and our community. This is a living document that is constantly being maintained by the Enigma team. Scroll down to discover more about Enigma. What is the Enigma protocol and how does it work? <clears throat> We've been solving for privacy and scalability since 2015, before many knew what blockchain was and could be. Enigma is one of the most ambitious and critical projects in the decentralization space, the missing piece to realizing a decentralized, more sustainable future. Enigma is building a decentralized open source protocol that lets anyone perform computations on encrypted data, finally bringing privacy to smart contracts and public blockchains. First founded and researched at MIT in 2015, Enigma turns ordinary smart contracts into quote unquote secret contracts, allowing developers to build thousands of new and valuable privacy preserving solutions. Enigma's mission is to improve the adoption and usability of decentralized technologies for the benefit of all. Our network test net is now live. Next up, the beginning of the Genesis game. Blockchains are bad at privacy by design, and as a result, traditional smart contracts suffer from significant limitations. They cannot use data that needs to be kept confidential. Enigma is building the first scalable platform for decentralized applications that can utilize sensitive or private data as inputs. Seeker contracts unlock the enormous potential of dApps and can revolutionize industries like finance, credit, gaming, machine learning, healthcare, and many others that depend on the use of sensitive data. They also help swing the balance of power over data back to the individual. How does it work? Our protocol breaks up sensitive data and distributes it in encrypted form across quote unquote secret nodes on the Enigma network. Nodes can then use this data to perform computations without seeing or exposing the raw data itself. As Enigma thus solves for scalability in addition to providing data privacy, we believe that the first decentralized applications with millions of users will be built on Enigma. And the Enigma is the critical missing piece to a decentralized future. Enigma was first described in 2015 in our CEO and co-founder Guy Zeiskind's MIT thesis as a follow-up to his foundational white paper, quote-unquote, Decentralizing Privacy. These two groundbreaking papers on privacy and blockchains are now some of the most highly cited in the space with over 500 combined citations. We're proud to have been the first project to recognize the essential nature of privacy solutions to the success of decentralization. And we're proud to continue leading this critical effort. These white papers were also early arguments for separating verification consensus and computation as a scalability solution. Enigma is committed to openness and inclusivity. We are a permissionless public network and we build in the open. Our public network testnet is already launched with more releases and milestones on the way. You can read more about our progress to date and upcoming priorities for the, the protocol in these blog posts. What can you build with Enigma? Enigma is an extremely versatile and flexible platform. It can be used to solve some of the most pressing challenges in the digital era. To highlight some of these challenges, we created the Enigma Solution Series. As an in-depth look at just a few of the innovative and powerful ways in which Enigma can be used. In the solution series, you can read about the breadth and depth of applications Enigma enables, including secret auctions, decentralized credit scoring, secure voting with TCRs, securing a dead man switch, and even determining whether you are human. 
Enigma has applications in dozens of verticals within the blockchain space, including DeFi, decentralized finance, and gaming, where privacy is critical to usability. One of the first and most important applications built on Enigma, Solid, solves transactional privacy for Ethereum. Enigma's protocol will help data privacy and ownership evolve as we build a more decentralized future, with the FX felt far outside the blockchain ecosystem. We previously written about GDPR compliance and how Enigma can help prevent the next Cambridge Analytica. The Enigma protocol has critical use cases within the cryptocurrency and trading landscape as well, such as enabling secret, more secure ICOs, and enabling decentralized relayers that can prevent front running. The above solutions are no means exhaustive. You can contribute your own ideas for potential applications for Enigma on our developer forum. How can you build with Enigma? You can begin creating your own secret contracts today using the most recent release of our protocol. Learn more about this release on our developer's blog, read our documentation, or jump right into our developer quick start guide. We recently closed our first round of developer bounties using Gitcoin. Please read this blog post for a recap and get ready for more rounds coming soon. We've also released a number of awesome walkthroughs as well as developer documentation for all the help you'll need getting started. All this material can be easily found in our developer resource index. If you have questions and want to talk to some of the folks in the community or on the Enigma team, you can visit our developer forum at forum.enigma.co and ask away. Lastly, if you've already working on a project and you think Enigma could be useful within your stack, fill out this company interest form. We are always excited to collaborate with other builders. The growing Enigma ecosystem. Enigma is being designed with end users in mind. We're not just an academic project. We want to build something that works at scale for both individuals and institutions. We want to make sure at every stage that we're solving real, tangible problems in the world, and we're already working with a number of amazing projects that have an urgent need to data, privacy, and scalability. One of our keystone partnerships is our collaboration with Intel, which outlines how Enigma will work directly with Intel and utilize Intel's SGX enclaves, or enclaves to dramatically increase speed and performance of private computations. We're also proud members of the Enterprise Ethereum Alliance and Decentralized Identity Foundation, focused on building real solutions. We're also a member of the Intel Ingenuity Partner Program and MIT Stex25. From the Stex25 website, Stex25 startups have been identified as particularly well suited for industry collaboration. These young, vibrant companies have proved themselves with early use cases, clients, demos, or partnerships, and may be the cusp of significant growth. Enigma nodes and the ENG token. Enigma performs privacy-preserving computations across a network of computational nodes, taking this demand off of the blockchain. By doing so, Enigma is solving for both scalability and privacy. Computational fees in the Enigma network are paid with ENG tokens, giving an economic incentive to nodes that perform private computations and form consensus on state. Enigma's quote-unquote secret nodes are similar to master nodes, requiring the ENG token to be staked in order to ensure computations are performed correctly and to secure the network's integrity. Staking more ENG gives nodes a higher chance of selection for computational tasks and thus receiving ENG as fees. The ENG token can be thought of like gas on the Ethereum protocol. Users pay the nodes on the network to run computations. The minimum, the minimum stake for a secret node is 25,000 ENG. Mainnet secret nodes are being selected during a testnet period called the Genesis game. During this period, the nodes with the most staked testnet tokens enough time will qualify as Genesis nodes. Genesis nodes are the first nodes in our network and the only ones eligible for block rewards and fees in the early stages of the protocol. If you're interested in becoming a secret node runner, please read the below blog post thoroughly as they contain critical information on participating in the Genesis game. As Enigma proceeds along its roadmap, nodes will be divided into two types outlined below. Further details can be found in this more extensive exploration of, of Enigma nodes and staking. Secret nodes. Secret nodes are network participants that run a node in the Enigma network and ensure secret contracts are ex executed in a privacy-preserving manner. Nodes in Enigma network can be thought of as performing a function similar to miners in Bitcoin. Consensus nodes. Consensus nodes will operate the Enigma blockchain itself. They validate computations and set the final ordering of state changes. In our first release, Discovery, these type of nodes are not yet available to run as we instead rely on Ethereum for verification. Please fill out this interest form to become part of our secret nodes mailing list. You can also post on a developer's form to join our community telegram. Full blog series on secret nodes can be found below.
Enigma's privacy technology. As mentioned earlier, Enigma aims to use a combination of cryptography-based privacy technologies like secure multi-party computation and hardware-based privacy technologies like trusted execution environments. Our team is well equipped to utilize both technologies effectively given our expertise in SMPC, dating back to our original white papers and our ongoing collaboration with Intel around secure hardware and privacy preserving technologies. Here is a short description of privacy technologies and their advantages taken from our blog on CoinMarketCap. Secure multi-party computation. Known as MPC for short, secure multi-party computation starts by asking a philosophical question. Is there any trusted third party, a supercomputer of sorts, that we can send our data to and trust it to perform computations on our behalf without potentially leaking our private information? This is the equivalent of envisioning a server that can never be hacked or compromised internally or externally an idealized scenario. Since this is not possible in reality, or else we wouldn't need security at all, we instead aspire to simulate such an omnipotent and trustworthy machine. MPC proposes to emulate such a trusted third party by combining untrusted parties. In other words, we can design a decentralized network of computers that will ensure that no data leaks during computation. Each computer in the network only sees encrypted bits of data, but never anything meaningful. The only way to recover into plain text data is by having all the players in the network collude to leak data as opposed to gaining control of the secret key. The number of systems needed to reconstruct the data is a tunable parameter that can range from some portion of the system up to all of them. Trusted execution environments. As opposed to the above techniques, trusted execution environments or TEAs are a hardware-based privacy solution. In a T-based network, secure hardware is used to protect the data that is being used from leaking outside the hardware itself. Using techniques like remote attestation, users of the network can be sure that the encrypted data submitted to the network remains private. The primary trade-off of T's is that you must trust that the hardware has not been compromised. However, performance can be significantly faster than with purely software-based methods of secure computation. Combining the power of T's with a decentralized network, as Enigma does, creates a more robust privacy solution. Combining T's with other privacy technologies creates even more opportunities, and this is an active area of research for our team. Zero knowledge proofs. Zero knowledge proofs or ZKPs are a specific kind of secure computation and note that they are less general than the above techniques. ZKPs focus on proving slash disproving statements. The goal is to have the prover prove to the verifier some argument without revealing any other information. The simplest type of ZKP are proofs of knowledge. In this version, the prover must show that he possesses knowledge of some secret information without revealing it. If the rules of the game were different and we didn't care about revealing the secret information, then the solution would be trivial. Simply show the secret to the verifier. Instead, we must find another way. One significant real-life example where ZKP are useful is authentication. One could prove his or her identity by showing they have knowledge of some secret passphrase or a key, without actually providing that secretly directly. However, this property creates a shortcoming as one can only prove secrets that has access to, in other words, in multi-actor systems such as auctions, we would still need to trust an auctioneer to compare all the bids and reveal the winner and share the secret. The recent interest in ZKP stems from the introduction of SNARKs, Zero Knowledge Succinct Non-Interactive Arguments of Knowledge. ZK SNARKs are a special form of ZKP that is also non-interactive. The prover and verifier aren't required to be online at the same time. And succinct, the proofs are small in size, which makes verification fast. The two major shortcomings of the technology are that generation, generating the proof is still, incredibly, and is still incredibly slow, proving relatively simple statements would still take minutes, and that the cryptographic assumptions used as fairly new and not well established in a ca academia or industry. Fully homomorphic encryption. Fully homomorphic encryption, or FHE, is a purely software-based solution to privacy. Recall that an encryption is a where you can hide data in a way that it will appear meaningless to anyone except those who have access to the secret decryption key. One shortcoming of encryption is that generally, doing a computation over the ciphertext space does not affect the ciphertext in the same way as doing the computations over the plain text data. If, however, it does, then we call this scheme homomorphic. Imagine we have two values, A and B, and using a homomorphic encryption algorithm, we obtain the encrypted values EA and EB. If we attempt to add EC equals EA plus EB together, then EC would equal an encryption of the sum of A plus B. 
In other words, when EC is decrypted, it would result in the sum of the two integers. Note that for now, FHE remains a theoretical advancement, and it is very challenging to make these types of schemes practical for real-world uses. The future of Enigma. Enigma has previously announced a number of planned public releases, each adding additional functionality to our protocol. This began with our initial testnet release in June 2018 and will continue with the upcoming release of Discovery. Discovery introduces Secret Contracts 1.0, which, which will allow the entire state of a computation to be encrypted throughout. This finally enables dApp developers to include sensitive data in their smart contracts without relying on centralized and less secure off-chain systems. Discovery introduces network nodes and node rewards and will also allow Enigma's core virtual machine our computation engine to support WASM. This allows for most of what's needed to have Oracle functionality already built into Enigma, as well as providing a common computation engine for any privacy-preserving technology we'd like to implement. Voyager is our secondary. Uh, Voyager is our second major release, focusing on even stronger privacy for dApps. This will utilize a new distributed VM that would allow to run general-purpose secure multi-party computations (MPC). This would allow developers to choose between different execution engines for their secret contracts, either T's, Secret Contracts 1.0, or MPC, Secret Contracts 2.0. Valiant will introduce a fully open and secure consensus in the Enigma chain while increasing performance through the use of more elaborate sharding. Defiant brings complete chain independence. The Enigma network will operate its inner Enigma chain completely independently of other networks. In this release, we will also release major updates to cryptographic protocols, primarily around MPC, which both increase security and decentralization. Defiant is the definitive training wheels off phase for Enigma. All of this is subject to adaptation and change. Every release and optimization of our network is a critical step toward our ultimate mission, growing and improving Enigma, scaling our developer community, achieving global adoption, and solving the world's biggest challenges to privacy while improving decentralized technology. Decentralize this, presented by Enigma. As part of our educational responsibility to the community, we wanted to explore the challenges that are holding back decentralized technology from widespread adoption, while simultaneously emphasizing how critical collaboration is to achieving our shared goal of a decentralized future. Decentralize this is a podcast featuring guests from all over the decentralization space, developers, investors, entrepreneurs, researchers, writers, artists, people in government and enterprise, all individuals who care deeply about building a more decentralized and sustainable world. The question we seek to answer is, how can all these people with different perspectives collaborate to create a, and scale the technologies we need to shape a better future? As we head back over to the coin market cap side, we can see that they have a correlation chart between itself, Bitcoin, and Ethereum. We want to see how this actually relates, Bitcoin being that of gold and Enigma being in green and Ethereum being in red. As far as the price action movement up, we do see a relationship pushing into January 2018 around the time when Bitcoin hit its $20,000. Had a bit of a trail off going down, a little bit of a push up back into May, which is we've seen pre being pretty consistent with some other coins. As well as we move then into 2019, we want to see if there's anything around the June period. And surprisingly, there's not much of a push up with that of Enigma around the June period when Bitcoin hit its $14,000 price point. A little bit of an uptick around December of 2019. All-time low on December 17, 2018 at approximately 20 cents or 0 0.204871 United States dollars. All-time high was actually the same year on January 10, 2018 at $8.30. Market rank as of the time of this video is number 111 on the list. Enigma's return on investment at negative 35.23%. Market capitalization at approximately $29 million. Volume in the last 24 hours at $2.5 million approximately, with a circulating supply of 74,836,171 ENG, and a total supply of 150 million ENG. As far as the sources that are working with Enigma, we have, as of the time of this video, 28 being listed. Sources and pairs are intertwined. Sources include Bilaxi, Binance, Alterdice, Hotbit, Bitrue, Mercatox, QB Global, Kyber Network, Hotbit, Dextrade, Bitrix, VCC Exchange, Bitcub, IDEX, QB Korea, Crex24, GoPax, HitBTC, and CoinPlace. 
And that does it for this overview of Enigma. Let me know what your guys' thoughts and opinions are down below in the comments. Do you guys feel that this has a promising future? Do you feel this is going to fall flat on its face? Do you feel it's better or worse than another coin? Do you have any price predictions? Let us know down below. As well as if you guys enjoyed the video, it would be greatly appreciated if you guys drop a like here. And if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. We're covering a lot of different cryptocurrencies on this channel as well as doing a series of how-to tutorials walkthrough guides, uh, glossary terms, and covering major news and events for Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. I hope you have a lovely day, and I will see you guys later.